Welcome to Harold's Cross, where tonight we have the semi-finals of the Bookmakers Puppy Derby. Two great races in prospect in the first semi-final. Unfortunately, just five runners, Farron Crash and Absentee. The big three here in the betting are Tully Murray Acton three, Mays Castle in four, and Westmead Bond well drawn in six. And away they go on his number three, fast out, Tully Murray Axe. So is four, Mays Castle on the outside, six, Westmead Bond. But into the bend and three takes over. That's... Uh, Tully Murray act into the back by a couple of lengths from two now Cornamati flash moves through into second then comes one Vito Mave in third but it's three Tully Murray act around the third bend with a lead of two and a half lengths from two Cornamati flash then comes six Westmead Bond running on in third but up the straight it's number three Tully Murray act going on to win it Tully Murray act the winner second is two Cornamati flash and third number six Westmead Bond the time 28.52 uh, he's very very good you know he does everything right he's lovely dog to train it's quiet as can. Lovely temperament. Good tonight, temper. a very, tonight a very impressive victory. Popped out. Did everything right. Like There's some fast posts behind him. Yeah, it's the first lane now actually. Very happy with him because he did everything right. You know, He's starting to go down and get his break on right and he did everything proper tonight. And when he went around the first bend then I knew he had a serious chance of winning. Of course, he's not with you all that long so settling in would have been an issue, I'm sure. Yeah, settling in would have been an issue. Like He was in great shape coming into me, you know, so didn't have, he wouldn't improve there. But like you see, he's fully settled now and that'll, that'll, uh, that'll help him. Well, now following the excitement of that opening semi-final, we move on to the second qualifier. Quite a race in prospect here with Westmead Grant in six, a very popular runner here around the Harold's Cross, and the real dangers appear to be three Dean Ridge Rage and one Cornamaddy Swift. And away to go, fours away smartly, Freedom Ball, but so is six Westmead Grant going up strongly on the outside. It's six Westmead Grant clears the corner. Three is badly balked on the bend, Dean Ridge Rage. And into the far side, and Grant has gone clear. It's six, Westmead Grant, out by five, six lengths at this stage, clear into the third bend. And it's number six, Westmead Grant, way out front. There's all sorts of trouble in behind, chasing it as one Cornamati Swift in second, but it's six, Westmead Grant, running out a very impressive winner here. Second is one Cornamati Swift, and third, number five, Bonville Johnny. The time, a brilliant 28.42. Trap six in the final, of yeah. course. The twenty-eight forty-two again, probably good enough. I hope so. I hope so. What's the plan with the dog now? He's he's had a good few uh, weeks running. Yeah, I'm going to, we can leave him off after this, you know. He's been on the go for a long time now, you know. So. Yeah. He's a bit of a special dog. He's a lot of gears. He is all right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. A good final, though. Good final. All good final. Yeah, Pat Buckley's dog's running well too, you know. So. I mean, the best dog win next week. You'll settle for a two length lead in the back, would you? I will, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the trap draw for the final of the 2009 Harold's Cross Bookmakers Puppy Derby. One Cornamaddy Flash. In two, Cornamaddy Swift. In three, Tully Murray Act. Four is Bonville Johnny, a middle seed. Five, Westmead Bond, another middle seed. And in six, the sole wide seed, Westmead Grant. Well, you've just seen the trap draw for the final of the 2009 Harold's Cross Bookmakers Puppy Derby. It really does promise to be a thriller, although we're going to have two dogs dominating the betting. No doubt Westmead Grant in Trap 6 will probably start the favourite, but Tully Murray Act is a real prospect with a massive future ahead of him. Two top-class greyhounds, and they're likely, as I've said, to dominate the betting, and indeed, probably dominate the action. But it really does promise to be a cracking final. If you are free next Friday night, why not join us here at Harold's Cross for the 2009 Puppy Derby Final? Thank you.